Hey everyone, how's it going? Welcome back to another video here. So I wanted to talk about something that's a little sad, I guess, but it's also going to be an interesting era that we're going to enter, I guess, really in the next, well, I guess in a month from now, which is we'll be in a world where The Walking Dead isn't filming anymore, which is, I, yeah. The Walking Dead has been filming for since 20 or 2009, I think, right? 2009, I think, is when they started filming or they they start. Maybe the casting stuff was going on. And anyways, that's definitely going to be a sad day once it actually happens. And it's, and it's happening in a month from now, like within the next month, uh, The Walking Dead is, is completely done filming. And there was actually a photo posted out there. Uh, apparently, the script has now been sent like the very, very last episode script has now been sent to everybody. So I want to, yeah, I want to talk about that and some other things. So obviously before going any further, make sure to be a subscriber if you want more walking to content like this. If you haven't followed my Twitch yet, definitely go do so. We just finished up playing some Phasmophobia, which is so much fun. It's a really fun uh, ghost game. We're getting so much better at it right now. Really the only issues I'm sort of having, I guess, are more of inter internet connection issues. And it is just the, the streaming side of it. It really is just like the internet part of it. And I think I do need to restart my computer right before I stream. There's something off with it, but it's it's a simple fix, I think. It's just, yeah. Anyways, it's fun when you guys are there. This Sunday, we are going to be doing another Walking Dead live stream, waiting for episode 10 to air. And then you guys will hear my reactions to episode 10. So definitely go follow me on Twitch. The link is down below. It's just at Appetite for the Dead. And um, yeah, so we see this photo and I'm not going to show the photo. The reason why I'm not going to show the photo is because apparently the, the person that posted the photo was uh, he actually had to take it down. And the reason is because a lot of people and I mean, a lot of people were, were trying to like turn the brightness down or, or the contrast, you know, they're, they're trying to basically just like manipulate the lighting of the photo to try see through the, the, the first page to be able to read everything underneath. Which is actually really possible and has actually been kind of successful because they did dis uh, decipher a few words here. Nothing of significance. There's one thing I think that says Atlanta, but like, again, I, I don't think it really means anything. Like, I, I don't, they're very far away from Atlanta. So unless they were going to return to Atlanta in the last episode, I also still don't really understand the point of that, really. I guess you could if, you, if you're, you know, you have the Commonwealth back, you bring all those resources back to Atlanta, you go rebuild the farm. Maybe Maggie wants to go back to live on her father's farm. You know, I don't know. Maybe there's a lot of things that you can do there. But if anything, you know, they film near Atlanta. They film in Georgia. If anything, it was probably just thanking this and that or just saying something to do with the staff or, or whatever. So there's not, again, it was the second page. Who knows when the, the script actually began? So I, I, yeah, I wouldn't read too much into that. I really wouldn't. But still, it was still actually pretty crazy that the fact is, you know, this is the final script that has now been sent in to the cast. And uh, yeah, they're going to be reading how The Walking Dead ends. And as of now, I believe they all know. Norman Reedus and all of them most likely know how it all plays out. They know, you know, which characters are going to be there or whatnot. If, there, if there's a death, if there's going to be a big time jump, they all already know now. So that's just, yeah, that's out there now. We're in a Walking Dead world now where that stuff is out there and the actors know. So I just, I, I wanted to bring this up in a video just because it's it's really shocking, to be honest. It's like, I can't believe we're actually at that point now where the show is, I mean, I guess it makes sense. The show's ending this year. And the thing is, it's because it's still so far away, right? Like, I know they're they're, they're wrapping up filming next month. But we're not going to see this episode for another nine months, right? The Walking Dead is going to end in like nine, nine and a half months from now. Like it's going to be the end of November, right? So we have all the way until the end of November, almost like basically almost Christmas time, right? Thanksgiving time for, for Americans. So still a very long time away. We have so much stuff to go through. We're, we're currently in part two. We're going to have Tales of the Walking Dead. We're going to see Madison's return. We have to go through a whole other Comic-Con and then get through in a whole other eight episodes and then Fear the Walking Dead season eight, you know, just... It's still quite a bit of ways, but it, it is it is going to fly by, you know, like what was nine months ago? That that would have been May, right? So like May last year. So basically, you know, yeah, that, that's still a really long time away. Like that, that's actually super far. But yeah, I mean, this is pretty crazy. The script says end of series. It's an end of series script. Um, it, That's the end of The Walking Dead. And, you know, I really hope they stick the landing with this. And I, I do think they're going to. I think they're probably so stressed out about it. They're like, we need to do this right for for the fans, for everyone. Um, because the Walking Dead fandom's not going anywhere, right? And it's one of those things that, like, as soon as the show is over, the fandom is going to feel empty. <laughs> like, we're all going to want something to watch. We're all going to want something Walking Dead related to watch, but we want those characters specifically. So, you know, that's why the Daryl and Carol spinoff is going to be really well received, because we're all going to be like, man, I miss those characters so much. I want, 
I want to be in this story. So many people are going to be so sad. It's going to be such a big moment. But we're going to want to be in that universe because of Rick Grimes, because of the things there with Rick, right? And and so that's why the Rick movie, to live in the world again, to be with that character is going to be so much fun. Uh, We're going to have the spinoff with Daryl and Carol. I mean, really, with The Walking Dead ending... What we're mostly saying goodbye to is everyone else, right? Like we're saying goodbye to Rosita, to Gabriel, to Aaron, um, to everyone else, Ezekiel, if he's still alive, like to uh, to all of those cast members, to Judith as well. We're saying goodbye to Judith for a very long time. Potentially Maggie as well, like Maggie and Negan, we could be saying goodbye to. I don't know if they're going to do spinoffs with those characters. Maybe Maggie joins Daryl and Carol. Like, that's also possible. But I think Maggie, if anything, is going to stay at the Commonwealth. So, like, we're going to be saying goodbye to a lot of those characters for a while, especially Negan. I think Negan, he'll probably return, you know, two or three years down the line. I think that they'll do a spinoff. They'll do something with the character for sure. But it's not going to happen right away. They're going to do the Daryl and Carol show first, right? So we're not saying goodbye to those characters. So maybe that's why I'm not, I don't, I don't feel so sad about the Walking Dead ending because we're basically getting that show right away. But there's still that element there. Like, it's going to be very heartbreaking the day it actually happens, you know? So far, the season is on the right path. Like, I think uh, episode nine really fixed that. Like, I as soon as they, they did that refresher there, just the whole episode there of episode nine, it really sort of, it got rid of that that bad feeling we had about the show, just in, in the sense of, like, if we felt bad about this storyline or, or, like, oh, it's, it's not, it doesn't feel like the final season. It doesn't feel as epic. Well, now we're actually at that point where it does kind of feel like that. So I'm really excited for that. Episode 10 looks really great. I'm really excited to actually watch the episode. I can't wait to meet Pamela Milton. Like, we're actually going to meet Pamela Milton in this Sunday's episode. I'm so excited for that. I want to see her talk. I want to see what her mannerisms are like, her attitude, you know? I keep picturing her just being, like, very, like, I don't even know what, really. Like, I just want to hear her talk and just sort of do anything. We've just been seeing pictures of her, and we'll see her move a little bit. But, like, really, it's been nothing so far. And I I love the actress. She was in The Boys, and I I really liked that. Like, obviously, I love that show. So I'm kind of imagining a very similar performance, but obviously, well, we're just going to have to wait and see with that. But I can't wait yet. Pamela Milton this Sunday. But anyways, I'm going to leave it here. Uh, Yeah, this is a a sad day in a sense, right? Like, the end of series script was sent into the actors. It was going to happen at some point, right? Like, at some point, this was going to happen. I'm happy that they're just going to rip the bandaid off, although it doesn't feel like they're doing it right now because we're still waiting for them to be done filming. So once we get to that day on like what, March 14th, March 15th, once it's the last day and they announce The Walking Dead has concluded filming forever, then it's going to feel like, whoa, the show is whatever it is, is that that's just what it's going to be now. Now it's just time for them to edit, put everything together, make everything exciting. And I I know they're going to probably feel like, is this enough, right? Like, they're probably going to have those feelings, which is why they don't actually take anything down in terms of the set and all that until June, in case they have to go back and like, they're like, oh, I want to change this. I want to refilm this sort of thing so they can get the actors and actresses back. But yeah, anyways, I'm going to leave it here. Post your reactions down below. Are you guys ready for The Walking Dead to be over? Hope you guys all enjoyed the video and I'll see you guys in the next one.